my player right now. Okay. I'm gonna play maybe like 20, 35 minutes of this and see how it is. There we go. Cruiser weight striker specialist powerhouse giant mm. cruiser weight.
I'll be right back. Here we go. Red was one of the toughest opponents I ever faced. No matter how hard I hit her, which was pretty hard, she never backed down. Sorry, it feels strange to stand up here and talk about her in the past tense. Don't get me wrong, I'm honored to do this, but I never thought it would happen so soon for Red or her best friend, Trey. Wherever Red went, Trey was there too. And tonight's no different. 
They truly are a package deal. They always had each other's backs, and that was certainly the case when I faced off against Red in the Money in the Bank ladder match. Right now, this is anyone's match as far as I'm concerned. I'm sticking with my pick of the rookie sensation, Red, to take home the briefcase. Red faced an uphill battle just to qualify for this match. You have to wonder if that will affect your chances here tonight. Of course it will. You need to be full rested if you want to win a grueling match like this. And Red came into tonight running on fumes. Right across the face. Oh, what a right! Man, that's just an attitude behind it. Inside the ring. Avoiding trouble there. And scissors Ooh, take that. Oh, very nice. Absolutely spiked. DDT. Man. There she goes. Oh, again. It's going to be a race to the briefcase between Red and Ronda Rousey. Hold on, the rest of their opponents are not ready for this match to be over. And Red and Ronda come crashing down. It's an absolute free-for-all to see who's going to get the money in the bank briefcase. Ronda and Red have recovered, and I think they might have other plans. Oh, no. This is total chaos. The window of opportunity is now wide open for Red and Ronda Rousey. Nice half kick. Great elevation. Did you see that? Just malicious. Really just laying it in. A nice shot by Shayna Baszler. Looking stunned. Looking rocked. Red setting up for something big. What is she doing? If Red thinks she can match Ronda Rousey with strikes, then she's insane. And now Ronda is punishing Red. Is it too late to change my pick? Wait a second. Red reverses. Zelina Vega has recovered and is setting up a ladder. She's using everything she has left to drag herself up each rung. But will it be enough? It might not be. Red's going to try to beat Zelina to the top. Hold on, it's Andrade. What's he doing out here? Is he putting Zelina Vega on his shoulders? How is this legal? It's not only legal, it's smart. It's Trey. I think he's seen enough from Andrade. Trey has neutralized Andrade. This pains me to admit, Byron, but you might have been right about your... In her first attempt, Red is going to win the Money in the Bank ladder match. Wait, it's Ronda Rousey. This isn't over yet. Ronda's got Red's arm. Armbar on the top of the ladder. She's got it locked in. Ah. Red's in big trouble. Yeah, it's going to be hard for her to grab a briefcase with a broken arm. Can she escaped before it's too late? Uh, this truly is a historic day. I don't think I've seen you dressed up since our senior prom. <laughs> oh, yeah. Our one and only date together because no one else would go with us. I remember showing up in that sweet, homemade, million-dollar man suit. Didn't you wear a cane mask? No wonder we couldn't get dates. <coughs> to be fair, 
The theme of the prom was a masquerade. Eh, still weird. You have the list, right? No, I thought you had it. Seriously? I put it in the safe just like you told me to. Man, the way you treat that thing, you'd think it was the Magnet Carta. Did you say magnet? Yeah, it's some really old, valuable magnet, right? Just get it out of there. No one was going to break into a hotel room and steal an old piece of notebook paper from high school. It's not just an old piece of paper. That list has been the roadmap to our entire careers, and now there's only one thing left to cross off. Did you forget the combination? It might have slipped my mind. But don't worry, I wrote it down on my phone. Which is also in the safe. This is why I always said we should have got the list tattooed on us. No chance of losing it and we'd have way more street cred. Yeah? Well, I'm gonna be getting a teardrop tattoo if you don't get that thing open. This is what's going to give us confidence, recognition, success, everything we've ever wanted. Your Earth Science Notebook is going to do all that? No. We're going to use it to make a list of everything we'll accomplish someday when we become WWE superstars. We could do that. Or we could play my favorite lunchtime game, Guess What Mr. Bowman's Sweat Stains Look Like Today. I'm kind of seeing a heart shape. What do you think? I think you need to take this seriously. Besides, it's a proven fact that if you write down your goals, it helps you achieve them. Actually, now I'm thinking it looks more like a one-eared rabbit. Fine. I'll go first to get the ball rolling. Become WWE Divas Champion. Your turn. Okay. Star in a WWE action movie. Really? That's one of your goals? Do you want me to do the list or not? Besides, it's a proven fact, WWE action movies are some of the finest pieces of cinematic art ever produced, so it would be an honor to appear in one. <laughs> Whatever. Train at the dungeon. Come up with awesome wrestling names. Team with Mickey James. Get my own action figure. Compete on NXT. Win a dance-off. Wrestle Lita. Find out what's inside Undertaker's urn. Get inducted into the WWE Hall of Fame. Be in a WWE video game. Win a ladder match. I've got a match for you. My butt, your face. What are you two fartwads doing? This table is reserved for wrestling team members only. I thought there was a lot of boogers stuck underneath it. <laughs> Bunny, you can leave now. Sorry, we're busy. Get my own action figure, become WWE Divas Champion. Is this some kind of WWE nerd vision board? Hey! Being immortalized in semi-posable plastic is the greatest thing a human being can achieve. Don't ever touch our stuff again. What, like this? <laughs> that was a huge mistake. Are we gonna have a lunchroom match? Ah. 
This reminds me of that movie with the spinning top. Everything's confusing and a little bit off. For example, I wasn't even a WWE commentator when Red was in high school. Well, you're barely a WWE commentator now. None of this makes sense. Just sit back and enjoy the ride, Saxton. Brooklyn Von Braun is a terrible human being and deserves everything she's getting here tonight. I could not agree more, Michael. Four! Five! Brooklyn might have an opening here. Brooklyn gets nailed with the sliding lunch tray takedown. Can Red capitalize? She's going up top. Red with the picture perfect moonsault. That's it. It's all over. Red cemented herself as way tougher and cooler than Brooklyn will ever be. That's exactly what happens when you make fun of Red. You pay dearly. I'm still kind of confused about everything that just happened, guys. Well, don't hurt your imaginary head, Byron. Okay. Wait, 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 let me get this straight. You remember your fight with Brooklyn when we were in high school taking place in a WWE arena with a ring sold out crowd and commentators? The guy who can't remember the safe combination is questioning my memory? No, the guy who can't remember the safe combination is questioning your sanity. Whatever. I may have taken a few liberties with my story, but that is how I choose to remember it. Well, as much as I'd love to join you in rewriting history, that day is scorched into my brain because that's how I got my nickname, Trey. This is how it really went down. Okay. <laughs> what, did I hit her, hit her with a tray? Get my own action figure, become WWE Divas Champion. Is this some kind of WWE nerd vision board? Hey, being immortalized in semi-posable plastic is the greatest thing a human being can achieve. Don't ever touch our stuff again. What, like this? <laughs> that was a huge mistake. Oh no, I've unleashed Hothead Red. I'm gonna take that marker, bring it to your grandmother's nursing home and cross out parts of her chart so when the nurse goes to give her turndown service, she won't know to flip her over. That's right, I'm gonna give your grandmother bed sores. What is wrong with you? Why does that Calm sound like down. Bailey? Deep breaths, maybe we can talk this out. I'm done talking. <laughs> This is what happens when you mess with the captain of the wrestling team. What are you gonna do? Hit me with a steel chair? Put me through a table? I'm going to get help. <laughs> Everyone already knows Hothead Red, but let me introduce you to her best friend, Trey. Get it? Because he busted his butt on a lunch tray. Trey, 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 Trey. Oh. <laughs> now her face matches her nickname.
That could have been way worse. Yeah. Brooklyn could have posted a video of the whole thing online. Oh, wait. That's exactly what she did. I meant she could have dumped something worse on me, like mayo or hot sauce. And hey, at least she didn't destroy our list. So what? I'm not gonna do any of those things anyway. What do you mean? We were just embarrassed in front of the entire school, and currently 672 people on the internet. I bet a bunch of those are repeat views. Great! We're not even touching on the fact that I got beat up by a lunch tray. <laughs> I'm never going to be a WWE superstar. I'll just go to college and get a lame job like my parents want me to. <sighs> I think you need to read the letter again. This. See? This is what I'm talking about. I can't even open my locker. What's your combination? 16339, I think. Letter, please. Here we go. I think this section is relevant right now. You've probably asked yourself a million times, why? Why didn't they want to be my parents? The truth is, we did, but we had to make the hardest decision of our lives because we didn't feel we could give you the life you deserved. And that life is one where you can have the freedom to follow your dreams no matter what they might be, to become anything you want. Using the only letter I have from my real parents as some sort of motivational speech is kind of a cheap move. They're right, though. You got a second chance in life, and you need to make the most of it. So why sell yourself short? You need to at least try. Fine. But when this whole WWE thing doesn't work out, I'm blaming you. It'll work out. I promise. Assuming you never have to wrestle a lunch tray. They're actually a lot tougher than they look. Wait, was that, was that really the end of chapter one? No. <laughs> Okay, maybe my memory of that day is a little off. Severe emotional trauma will do that. <laughs> but did I really say all that stuff about her grandmother? Yep. You had some serious rage issues back then. Did you also forget that's how you got your nickname because you were always seeing red? No, I remember. And then Brooklyn tacked on the hot head part. <laughs> Gotta give her credit for that. You know, the rhyming definitely made it catchier. Hot head red, hot head red, hot head red. Okay, okay, we get it. Have you figured out that's safe yet? <sighs> no, but I'm pretty sure I use the same combination I've always used for everything, which is... Got it. Finally. Was never in doubt. I'm sorry you were locked in there all alone for so long. Mommy won't ever let that happen again. There's something seriously wrong with you. You're just jealous. We should get going. We can't be late. <coughs> hey, we got a message from President Johnson. Do you think you impressed the most electrifying president in United States history with all your career achievements? Actually, you do. All the best on your big day. I'll be watching from the People's White House. That's cool. <laughs> but I, I voted for Kane.
I'm gonna give myself a haircut.
I still can't believe it's really all over for you and Red. I know. It is starting to sink in, though. Just this morning, I was thinking about that time we faced each other in a Falls Count Anywhere match. Man, that was brutal. Yeah. But thanks to you in that match, now every time my jaw hurts, I know it's going to rain. <laughs> really? Maybe you should get that checked out. No way. You might be the champ who runs the camp, but I'm the champ who knows when it's damp. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't quite have the same ring to it. Hey, oh, yeah. Pull that match up on your phone if you don't mind. Hello, if you're new to the channel, please become a subscriber. AJ before this match, and both men admitted they didn't have a lot of experience in Falls Count Anywhere matches. Taking that into consideration, Trey did tell me he used a rather unusual training method to prepare for tonight. He played hours and hours of Falls Count Anywhere matches on WWE 2K. Yeah, because nothing will prepare you all the way from the top rope. Oh my AJ god! Styles losing some grip here. Styles has to get it together. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. Oh, he shows no mercy in that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. Corey, what can a superstar do if they find themselves playing defense in this match? You gotta find a way to create separation and buy yourself some time. Collect yourself. Otherwise, the beatings will continue. It's a battlefield out there, and you have to navigate around the landmines. He has become relentless at this point. Not sure where he gets that energy, but he's looking good right now. Oh, he's really taking it to him. Man, this is not good at all. Whack! Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Oh! Again! He's bringing it back inside the ring now. Going. Here we go. A spectacular maneuver. Oof. AJ Styles moved out of the way there. Incoming! He's looking to bring this one to the outside where things can get ugly in an instant. Styles great finding the leg. Rolls through. Close line over the top row. All the way to the floor. Big trouble for AJ Styles. Styles has to find some way to shake this off quick. Oh, nasty impact. Wow, AJ Styles is being controlled now. And AJ Styles makes him pay. What's AJ Styles going to do now? Suplex! Styles looking to end this thing. There it is. He hits it. Styles clash. One, two, three. And AJ 
Styles is your winner. Whatever. He only won because he reversed my signature. I spoke to Trey and AJ before this match, and both men admitted they didn't have a lot of experience in falls count anywhere matches. Taking that into consideration, <coughs> Trey did tell me he used a rather unusual training method to prepare for tonight. He played hours and hours of falls count anywhere matches on WWE 2K. Yeah, because nothing will prepare you for one of the most brutal matches of your career. Quite like sitting on a couch playing video games all day and night. What an idiot. AJ Styles looking a little out of his element. You don't see that very often. No need to panic. He's still swinging. Ooh, oh, what a punch. That's how you stop your opponent. Dangerous position here, guys. Oh, no, 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 Back no. Suplex on the air. Friend. The hardest part of the ring. Ducks under. Pele kick. Nicely done. Raw drop kick. Lightning fast reflexes. Wicked shot. Great counter. Impressive in-ring IQ on display. A rivalry has reached a new level when superstars collide in this combat zone. Corey, what are the keys to remember for the competitors? You gotta tee off on an opponent. Use everything in your vicinity as a weapon. It's about a competitor getting theirs by any means. The more damage you inflict, the better. Shows no mercy in that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. AJ Styles has taken a lot of damage. I'm not sure how much he has left in the tank. He won't quit, but it might be better if he did. AJ Styles might be headed for a rare loss unless he turns things around. He's just dominating at this point. Yeah, he's tapped into his reserves and is going strong. Again. Hey, it seems to be working for him. Ooh. Whack. Michael, that gives you meaning to have a seat. Did you hear that crack? Oh, what impact. Boom! Ho, ho, ho. <coughs> what a reversal by AJ Styles. Styles is always thinking. Between the eyes. Oh man, AJ Styles just got busted up. Terrible. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. There was a lot of force behind that one. Hard impact. He's going for the pen. This, this could be it. One, two. Ah, I you kick down. Unbelievable. The floor of the keys. AJ's in big trouble now. AJ Styles is in trouble. You can say that again, Saxton. Will it be? I think so. And at some point, he's going to start wondering what it's going to take to put him away. <coughs> oh, and he lands it. Really relying on that tonight. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Oh, what impact. Oh, the reversal by AJ Styles. 
Let's watch again how AJ Styles was toppled tonight. Overall, this match was average at best. But not every match is going to be memorable. In fact, I've almost forgotten it happened already. Remember this? Here is your winner, Jordan! Put it in the books. And there was no question about that one. I'm not impressed at all by AJ Styles' effort tonight. Well, I mean, he tried. And as we expected... I just wanted to congratulate you, Red. You really deserve this. Thanks, Natty. I know we had some differences over the years, but we always worked them out in the ring. Yeah, except that one time we got into it backstage. <laughs> I forgot about that. I didn't. You threw me into a road case. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. What were we even fighting about? The usual stuff. Who was better, the title, you saying you were the best female superstar to ever come out of Calgary. That's right, now I remember. have clearly gotten personal between Red and Natalia. This is on Red for claiming she was the best female superstar to ever come out of Calgary. That was pretty much a direct shot at Natty. Natalia is certainly proud of her legacy and will go to any lengths to defend it. Uh. Changes her fortune there. What the hell oh, you do from behind? Boom! Ooh. Right between the eyes. <laughs> and it's reversed. Paying for that mistake. Nice calf kick. Great elevation. Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Oh, again! 
She just keeps using that. Hey, wouldn't you? Ooh! Harsh impact. That's twice now, Byron. Yeah, she really knows how to handle that, huh? Ugh. This singles match has come to an end. <laughs> wow. Knock her out like a light. Hey, it's X-Pac. Just keep walking, we don't have time. We always have time for X-Pac. Besides, you can't just ignore a WWE Hall of Famer. I can. Trey. Pac, what's going on? Hey guys, looking good. You too. Thanks, I'm on this new mustard only diet. As in mustard is the only <coughs> condiment you use? No, as in I only eat mustard. I've already dropped like seven pounds. That's... Interesting. But enough about me. This is your big night. I swear it was just like yesterday when I first saw you two on the indie scene. Yeah, at that point we were only a couple years in. And I was about 30 years in. But I could still go today if I had to. I'm telling you, this diet's legit. I guess you could say you can cut the mustard, huh? Anyway, we wouldn't be here today if it wasn't for you. So, thanks. I'm sure you'd have been fine with it without my help. Trey, I don't think I can say the same for you. You were kind of the drizzling craps back then, no offense. No, it's true. And I wasn't just a drizzle. I was more like a torrential downpour of crap. Red was always ahead of me from the moment we started training. You can use this credit card for whatever you need, but we keep the reward points. I'm about 10,000 short of a free trip to someplace warm, and you're gonna help me get there. Deal? Got it. We are gonna miss no. you so much. When did you get there? I just had to be close to you one more time. I, it feels like yesterday we got that call, there was a boy in Denver who was ready to be adopted, and now you're all grown up and going off to college. I, I, I just can't believe it. <laughs> I know. Hard for me to believe, too. We'll come visit soon, okay? No, don't. I mean, a, a big part of college is learning independence, and if you're visiting all the time, then I'll never be able to do that. Just be smart about the credit card, okay? Like, if there's a big keg party, put it all on the card and have everyone pay you back in cash. That way, I'll be headed for that free beach trip in no time. Hey, maybe we could go on spring break together. Frank? I have to go. Okay, drive safe. This is the part where you get out of the car. <laughs> right. Call us when you get to school. We love you, Denver. Do you believe this? We're finally doing it. Our very first list item. Train at the dungeon. Are you excited as I am? I don't think that's possible considering you've already had three energy drinks before we've even left town. <laughs> but this is gonna be cool. I know. 
Think about how many top superstars came through Calgary. The Hearts, Edge, Jake the Snake Roberts, Rowdy Roddy Piper, and we're next. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. We have a long way to go before we can be mentioned in the same sentence as those legends. Everyone has to start somewhere though, right? And the dungeon is a great place to start. I still can't believe your parents were okay with all this. What happened to them wanting you to go to college? They changed their minds. Just like that? Just like that. Huh. Well, that's good. Hey, pull over real quick. Bathroom break already? No, I want to show you something. See that sign? Our faces are going to be on it someday. You really think we can become more famous than the inventor of the paper toilet seat cover? He put a lot of butts in seats. And when we make it to WWE, so will we. Alright, that's where we're going to stop for today. Please be sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you guys at the next one. Peace.